is mystery. A lot of young guys struggle with this, especially like the new age sort of young man who's maybe 17, 18, 19, 20 years old right now. Your mystery has been stripped away from you by yourself. You voluntarily seem to just literally take away all mystery that you had, you know, that this girl would, would see from you. And the way that you do this is because you've been conditioned and you've been told and you've been fed these lies to pretend like you're supposed to get into these like sort of modern, mundane, open conversations with women. Young men have been literally convinced that the way that they should speak to women is the same way that they should speak to like their male friends and they should like message each other all the time and be speaking and laughing together. No. I want you to think of a man like James Bond. Obviously he's like a fictional character, but you think of James Bond. He's a very mysterious man. Maybe he'll hook up with a girl, maybe he'll date a woman. And they don't really know what he's doing the next day. They wake up and he's just off to work. Like they don't even see him. He, they wake up and they know he's at work, but they don't really know what he's doing. That's attractive. That's so attractive. Why? Because now they're like a woman when you are mysterious, like James Bond, for example, she's sat at home thinking of all the possibilities that he could be doing right now. Whoa, he could be fighting like Russian agents. He could be invading like this country or this, or he could be like looking for this, this murderer or something. Wow. So exciting. Stay mysterious. Stay mysterious. She asks me, we're in the car together, me and this girl, right? She asks me, what have you done today? Sometimes, like, you know, I'm just kind of like chilling. It's, it's late or something. I'm tired. And I'll just be like, lots. 